What's up guys? In this tutorial, I will show you how to get your OpenAI API key. This key allows you to integrate OpenAI's API services, such as GPT models, into your projects or applications. First, open your browser and head to the OpenAI API Keys Management page at platforms.openai.com slash API Keys. You will need to be logged in to your OpenAI account, so if you haven't already signed up, make sure to create an account first. Once you're on the API Keys page, click on the Create New Secret Key button. This will generate a new API key that you can use for your projects. Keep in mind that each API key is tied to your user account and can make requests against the project you have access to. If you are ever removed from a project or organization, this API key will be automatically disabled. On the next window, you'll have the option to choose whether the API key is owned by you personally or by a service account. A service account is typically used for automated tasks or integrations. But for most users, the key will be tied to your own user account. Make sure to choose the correct option based on your use case. Below, you can name your API key. While this is optional, it's a good idea to give it a descriptive name, especially if you plan on managing multiple keys. You'll also see an option to select a project. If you don't have multiple projects, you can leave it set to default project. Next, you need to choose the permissions for your API key. You can select from all permissions, which grants full access to the API, restricted, which limits the API key's access. You can adjust permissions for different services, including GPT models, model capabilities, threads, fine-tuning and fine access. Or read-only. This option allows viewing data, but prevents any changes or modifications. If you opt for restricted, a detailed list of permissions will appear below. This allows you to configure access for specific tasks, such as model interference, fine-tuning or file uploads. Make sure to review these carefully if you're working on a large project with specific access requirements. This is important for maintaining security and preventing unauthorized access. Once you've made your selections, click on Create Secret Key. You'll now be shown the key. You can only view this key once. Be sure to copy and save it securely, as OpenAI will not allow you to view it later again. If you lose the key, you'll have to generate a new one. After copying the key, click Done. If needed, you can create additional API keys from the same page. I hope this helped you out. Leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.